Yeah, we are at the Skeleton Key Gallery, and uh, it also houses Collective, which isn't open yet. We had our soft opening so we could get the uh, gallery doors open and, and be starting to sell some stuff as I get more vendors in. And uh, after we get to where we want to be, we're going to open it up for a grand opening, which will have Collective inside, and, and we'll all be housed. BD Vending is another company in back that um, I also partner with. Um, collective, that's how all of this started. I started in the Gallery Go. That was my original home. And uh, we moved out of there. We, we grew, outgrew the space. I had a wall. And um, it all started because I had so many friends who make so many amazing things. And individually, it's hard to get your name out there. But collectively, we can do anything. And so that's how I started, uh, just taking things that other people made and selling them. And we've just been growing and getting new items in every day. We started with nothing. We didn't. We we had some money for paint, and then now, uh, like I said, we borrowed some money for paint. And everything else that you see, I had uh, Marcus brought his glass blowing equipment. Uh, my friend Brian brought our welding equipment. Um, ben Grote brought a pottery wheel. Aaron Jacobson brought his drum kit and all of his guitars in order to try to fill space. Um, we had nothing. All the displays, the other ones, are made out of items that we found for free at the landfill. So we're like upcycling like nobody's business over here. <laughs> you know, we're just filling space and making it work and making things as attractive as we can with nothing. <laughs> Hoping to make something. <laughs> A little can go a long ways. Right. I have uh, nine different artists that have done eight different um, live art murals, and they have paints here so that they're allowed anytime that the artists want to paint, they just come in and paint. Um, Collective's mission statement is, is really all about upcycling and doing everything that we can in order to help the environment by making hand-making things and letting people see what's out there. Um, for Skeleton Key Gallery, my goal is I want people to walk in here and I want them to see something they've never seen before. This is definitely set up more of a, like an urban setting. Um, I do a lot of shows like out in New York as well and I feel like this gallery in particular is at the same competitive, competitive level. I like to be able to encourage artists to not be shy and bring out their artwork and since I've been in town I feel like there's been a few artists that have climbed out of their shell a little bit more and took the chance of representing their artwork on our wall. Oh man, I hope we're all over the place. I hope the whole world's talking about it. Like, hey, have you checked this out? Especially for being in a smaller community, to be able to shine that kind of level in the art world is a beautiful thing.